And the detective ran around the car and snatched me up. That's when I seen U.S. Marshals pull up. Okay, so at this point, I'm being put into handcuffs, and I'm watching as four Suburbans come driving down my parents' road. As I'm watching this, I'm like, who the hell is that? They stop in front of my parents' house. Next thing you know, a ton of officers are hopping out with U.S. Marshals emblazoned across their vests. Pretty much from this point, they came up to me and asked if anybody was inside the house. They let me know that they were going to be doing a raid on my parents' home, searching for the weapon or any clothes or articles that could be used as evidence. They quick snapped the photo of me and then threw me in the back of a cruiser and hauled me to the county jail. The entire ride, the whole way there all i could think about was my little brother when we were leaving i waved to my little brother to open the door for him because he wasn't going to open the door he was listening to what i had to say just as we were taking off i seen him crack the door open when we got to the county jail they threw me into a holding cell and the detective came in with a sheet of paper he didn't even tell me the charges that they were charging me with he merely pointed to him on a piece of paper and said this is what you're being charged with the paper said attempted murder and assault 